and this is so uncharacteristic as Magnus puts his head down and runs his hands through his hair. He is furious at himself for allowing what could be a game deciding blunder. Holy smokes, this but is Vincent a Vincent is about to He's... move and, and oh, he takes he it. it. Takes on C3, yes. He takes on C3. And look at Magnus, he looks aside. It clearly indicates that he has noticed Knight takes E4. But it was so tempting for Vincent, he thinks like draw is enough, I trade the queens, what can happen to me, it's a very solid position, but Magnus cannot believe he's, look at this, he's just completely shocked of what happened. Oh my. Uh oh, I mean, also computer is uh, confusing us, or maybe Tadeus has a different position. Stand oh my eight. god, rook b5 check, oh my god. Oh my god, this could have been, you know, the biggest <laughs> save ever. This is so pretty. <laughs> My God, you know I'm I'm usually a stalemate king, but I have never seen stalemate on king against king on d5. Mating patterns are going to be spotted within milliseconds. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, he's he played it. G6. Oh my life! Oh my gosh! He's blundered he it. Brought the, he brought the king up to That's g6. That's it. Rook takes d6, ends it. Anish can barely yeah, contain think... his excitement. He's not writing the move down. No, he's not right. He can't believe it. He shook his head. That was a knot. He's confused. And Richard Report has. Look at him. Look at him. He's Geary. He's he can't believe it. And I can't believe it. He, he just took a breath. He is going to find it. He is looking. He knows it's there. And it's completely winning for White after Rook takes d6. Look at look at Anish. He can't believe it. Am I dreaming? Rook H. Oh, oh my oh. gosh! What a move! I did it! Oh my god, he's just turned it around! Oh my, what an unexpected move! Oh my god, I completely missed it. I did, that didn't even occur to me in my and, wildest dreams! And it's losing now because you, your queen oh can't move without land. losing the rook on f7. That's unbelievable, and you couldn't take it with the pawn because of the pin, and now Vinod is up a rook, and he should be able to win this game! Oh my god. Hikaru now recover with three pawns for the rook. And there's increment, so that's huge for Vinod. You got 14 seconds. He can just put all his pieces in dark squares. Queen g7, rook f8. You know, the bishop's gonna obviously stay in a dark square because it can't leave it, but now Vinod should not have any real danger in his position. Be two, be careful. A uh, draw offer. Probably a draw offer with bishop f7. Yeah, because bishop takes f7, rook takes c6, and the position is completely level. We see that both players have had some inaccuracies, and uh, they made some mistakes, and for Magnus missing bishop takes c6. Look at this, they're talking about it. Yes, c5, bishop takes exactly. c5. Oh! Exactly. So Hikaru is still with some questions to answer. What could be a, a wrong square? Um, if the king comes forward, on maybe onto the f-file, shifts towards the center, at some point, you've got to time it right, but the white queen what? Oh, like now. Oh! Could he have swapped queens there? Oh, and Hikaru Look saw it that. immediately. Hikaru... And he's shocked. Oh, my. And I should... We've got to show that. Happening? It's a draw. They've repeated the position three oh, times. Wow. But did Wesley have a win on that final move just before he agreed to draw? I'm... Suggests a big question here for Magnus. You can give a check with the bishop to f5, but White simply pushes the pawn, again attacking both the bishops at the same time. Magnus Carlson in big trouble. He does go for your idea, David, sacrificing the rook. And now it's all about is this a fortress? It's very strong. I've never seen a position like this before where you've got two bishops, you've got the poor Magnus there. Look at him, he's, he's gesturing. The engine says black is completely winning because what? look at g7 and g1 queen. That's it. What just happened? Terrible what? thunder, but Alexander down to three seconds. Will he? No, he what? doesn't. <laughs> Peter, I... Second takes with the rook, so now that bishop f2 is no longer possible. Rook e8. Move 60. Very frustrating for Fabiano what has happened in the last several moves. He needs to do it soon. OK, 
Okay, he brings his queen out. That's an extremely rare move. Um, I'm not sure I've seen that move before. Um, I thought I'd seen everything there is under the sun after four moves, but Jan Napomnici gives away a half smile. He knows that that is a risky decision by Carlson. White bishop now. Look at that light square bishop. Just too strong, right? so well. He's, He's so, so I mean, I mean, the thing that I, I think was mentioned, he had this break, didn't he? Oh, it's over. Sorry, yeah, over. <laughs> it's over. Pragnananda is the winner of the match against Chakriyan Mamadiaro shaking his uh, hand.